What about chargebacks? Is that something that we would want to put in the contract? No, absolutely. In our template, we definitely have it. But it's something that definitely, definitely should be addressed. You don't want anything to surprise any of your clients, honestly. Right. You don't want anything to come as a surprise. So yes, it should be laid out in your agreement. Specifically the chargebacks. If somebody calls their bank up and says, hey, I need to cancel this payment or I didn't make this, I didn't agree to this, they can issue what's called a chargeback with the bank. And that's actually not a good thing for the business owner from a banking standpoint. I am not an accountant. I'm not and a also, lawyer. also, it, it sucks the money back from you. So it's not great. It's like a forced refund. Yeah, exactly. And so... How would we want to include that, that kind of language, or what, what would we want to include in the terms and conditions with regard to chargebacks? You know, it's kind of part of the refund policy, honestly. You lay out the refund policy really clearly, whether that's no refunds or refunds only in certain situations. And then you say, our language says something like, because this refund policy is very clear, we do not tolerate chargebacks. And if you attempt a chargeback, we can send your claim to collections because basically now they've got an, almost like an unpaid invoice or, you know, an amount owing to your company. And that can be useful if you do get in a chargeback dispute. So mm -hmm. what happens with the chargeback is the credit card company or the bank will say, Rick, we got a chargeback. They say it was not authorized. And you can say, no, no, I have a signed contract. And, you know, they showed up on all these dates. They did all these things. They used my services. They agreed. And sometimes, you know, not always the credit card companies are tough on these, but sometimes that will win the day. We have had clients who've been able to get over chargebacks. We just got our first chargeback, Rick. So. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to think over the years. So I think I've quote unquote won one. One of them, even yeah. with all of the evidence that we've, you know, they're, they're very consumer friendly. Yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah. Oh, it's ridiculous. But it's just, again, it's like one more advantage in your court to have that in your contract. Yeah. And um, we do have clients who will send their customers to collections. So that is an option also. Okay.